October 14th, Monday. I'm back at the Subaru Telescope Array in Hawaii, way top of the mountain. Looking down, it's kind of cloudy down there. But looking at the sun, just staring at it, then I noticed something. Since it's in the hand of the wheat in Spica and Virgo, the harvest, and yesterday being Fatima, just stared at it, and then it just hit me. I realized, just looking at the beauty of that miracle right there, and then I started counting, I don't know what you call these spikes or reflections or um, I don't know the name of it. But I know that I started counting them from here to here is 12. So it comes out to 22. And then here, it's like, uh, I don't know if there's two of them or three of them. It just seems to be yesterday being Fatima, the 13th, and also where it's located in the constellation. Also with the comet, with numerous comets under the right foot where we have images of stepping on the snake and then it dawned on me maybe i don't know let me let me present it to you the blessed sacrament in the holy image you could tell it's like the holy mother back here and right here then i counted these these from the top where you got that with the sun look like a square from here to here is 12 just like the sun right now and it comes out to 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 the other one's 22 maybe i'm missing another one here but it just i found this too coincidental and also being in the constellation it it just is there something here i did a little research on the blessed sacraments then i looked and looked to see what the euristic what it meant what this meant because i i didn't know jesus and on the back actually too very beautifully are the two tablets of the ten commandments one of the most powerful symbols of god's presence to his people in the old testament that sacred ark of the covenant which was also something that the jewish people the, the people of israel adored because it was their closest connection to god's presence so how blessed are we to know that jesus becomes fully present in an even greater way to us in the eucharist so this is called a monstrance from the the word mostrare in italian to show a showing so an opportunity to behold the lamb of god in a powerful and an extended way from that moment of adoration in the mass when the priest again lifts up the eucharist and says behold the lamb of god um, so in the back of every monstrance there's usually a little window or door that opens up and in there is where we Okay, I'll leave the link down below, but it's just coincidental the timing. And then with all the events that's happening now with the possible W wars, World War Three getting closer and closer in Asia and Middle East and Russia and Ukraine. The third secret, uh, part of it being released about when the Ukraine and Russia prophecy. I mean, Ukraine at the time was part of the USSR. The last pope, it just goes on and on and on and on and on and on and on. So I found this connection, this connection, looking for a sign. And I think I found a sign. Maybe somebody could fine tune this, explore it, confirm it, expand on it. Um, because there's something here. I mean, if you really look at it, and it seems to be bigger today than yesterday and more expanded. I don't know if these are spikes of reflection, but it seems to be, and also up here, just like a, like a, I wish I could zoom into it. What I see is like a crown, like a crown. And that's what I have so far. Now let's get to the, the current. This will be the current. Okay, the time now is, I'm waiting for 1900 hours. Time is 18, 16 so look at the beauty of the sunset i mean let's go back a little bit you should capture look at the beauty of the sunset so we're at 18 30 we got about 45 more minutes till the comet appears and see how it looks like today it should be further north let's see the star chart there's a star chart right here right underneath okay that's that's where it's located right now let me put the music mute okay there it is right there you got comet 13 p and 2023A3, 20, and there's some others. There's some other comets. So it's so already this above right here. Constellation Virgo, sorry. Venus is in Libra, the scale justice. Oh, scale justice. I hope I get some justice here in uh, where I live at with the D. I want to see the my, um, try to, you know, do a payment plan. And so they're gonna leave me in third base, halfway to home. I mean, I'm, I'm, I've been, Told her I was broke. I mean, I didn't realize I was running into a into a, 
Laura to take care of that. I, I, I don't want to say nothing yet. Okay, so that's where it is. And as we go back, so today it should appear right here, right here. It's 18, 19 hours. Wait till 1900 and see what we see. Yep, I'm drawn to this. Even though I've... This is the comet. See the anti tail. Well, there's an anti tail. They say so that an illusion. See, look at like a beam towards the end. But that's my pin. There's the anti tail from Michael. And then we got more churches burning. A real old church. I mean, like what, 400, 500 years old? Got burnt in Chile. Yeah. I want to touch upon this a little bit. This was a. Uh, posted eight hours ago still subject to change i don't know the new the new updates and this one here is they're saying it's going to make a left turn right here it's going to make a left turn and this one's projected to go through north of puerto rico and then making either north or south so it's like they're split 50 50 and then there's like a barrier like a bubble here pushing it away i don't know so there's the comet And there was something else that caught my attention. I'm just strolling down. I mean, all this craziness. The Blessed Sacrament. That's basically what, something like that. If you look at it, look at it being shown, shown. And there's a snake that I talked about on the right foot. And we got about, what, four or five, six comets all lined up here. And that's where I served before. Canemal. And we had this, this crazy. This is insane. Three teenagers facing 10 years for making a mark on this. Here's the more in the church. I mean, there's been hundreds of churches being burnt since 2020. There was a stat. And this here, this is happening. This is, remember, churches are being burnt. And then we have the second, which is the fathers, the men, the family, the children. That structure. There was a structure. And this will be the final battle. Remember, this is guys an exorcist, so. One of the things that demons do is that they attack the institution of marriage. The reason that we want to observe that they attack marriage is in order to harm and damage the children. Because they know if they can harm them or damage them in relationship to the marriage of the parents, that when they're young, then they will have a greater opportunity to possibly control them in the future. In other words, when people are wounded or damaged, that is, because that's what wound is. Wound is a kind of damage on the skin, etc. But it's the same thing in true in relationship to psychology. Demons know that if you can wound a person when they're young, their psychological faculties don't function in a normal way. And as a result of that, they're more easily controllable and manipulatable. Sin, trauma, abuse on the side of parents and others is the way in which children are formed in the minds of the demon to be susceptible to doing whatever they want them to do. In other words, you just weaken them, and then that way you can just control them. Yeah, they attack marriage, and then you got people benefiting, benefiting from this. They're making billions. They will lie to you. They will use you. They will manipulate you. They will steal from you. That's why a lot of fathers and a lot of veterans are doing themselves in. They're so evil evil they're i mean they gotta be from hell they got to be marriage is in order to harm and damage the children so this is from an exorcist top-notch exorcist here's the site right here if you guys want to go on twitter x and check it out but um oh god there's so much that i want to reveal so much they don't even realize people don't even realize the tests that's being being conducted now they're, they're just more concerned about money property stealing manipulating i mean that's how we've become they attacked uh they, i mean i was a father's rights activist since the late 80s and i know the child support casualty list where men did themselves in and hurt others okay so i know all that stuff and i know the root cause and we see so we see, we know what, who they're after. This is sad. How many churches are burning? 
are burning. This this was like what four five hundred year old church. Look at four hundred fifty eight attacks on Catholic Church across the United States since May twenty twenty. Four hundred and fifty eight. These are Catholic churches, not the other denominations that are burning. Also, this is a full scale attack uh, on on anything to do with Christianity. I mean, these are these are monuments from the for hundreds of this well four or five hundred years here. Imagine the the beauty inside. I try to get a video of of the inside, but a lot of these they don't record it. We got activity over there in in, in D.C. We don't know what what happened. It looked like a meteor or or asteroid. Or, or something crash. So many. Remember we're in the, the meteor showers. The Dracodin and the. Um, what's the other one? The Orions. So we have that. And then we got the comet tail. And who knows what, what, what tag along was with, with the comet. So. And then they. They got U.S. Uh, deploying troops to. To Israel. And now with this thing with the, the Middle East, I mean the the with the with the Asia with the dragon. I mean this is sad. So many churches are on fire, and in in inside the the beautiful painting, the ancient painting, the 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 the, the, the I don't want to say relics. Um, memories, painting, pictures, statues, bur burning, burning. And here come the, the firefighters are not attacking it. What the hell are you walking around, damn it? Just start putting water on it. Jesus. It's like they want it to burn. Look at it, walking around. What, they can't find the the the, the water uh, fire hydrant? And a lot of people are feeling drained lately. I mean, I'm feeling drained lately. A lot. So, so th there we have it. I mean, there's so much. So much happening.